up everybody it's the goal 60 here for monday august the 12th 2019 so the weekend was pretty crazy for us it took us to a third day on a revenge play to cash but we did cash it and we move on to the day where we got a couple games starting up uh potential for a couple more games starting up we'll get into all that we'll talk about the ones that missed the ones that's unofficial everything right after this All right, to start off, we did have two potential revenge plays today. One of them was pretty obvious as soon as I wrote the matchup down that wasn't going to happen, and that was with Baltimore and New York. The Yankees are in the top three at .535. The Orioles are in the bottom three at .466. Even though yesterday the Orioles did, did bounce back from losing like 23-2 to on Saturday and actually beat the Astros yesterday, as a plus 375, I, I heard that it even was an average in Vegas around plus 380. So if anybody was crazy enough to take it, one of the largest lines I've ever seen in my life. I think the favorite actually got up around minus 500 or, or more. But plus 375 is what I've seen it at, and that's they won the game outright. So crazy there. But today, as far as our revenge game goes, just you know, too far apart. Both of them are in the don't bet against, don't bet on categories so therefore too many factors going in for it not to play now the other one we did actually get a play out of and it is colorado and arizona colorado is the team we're looking at here at 0.497 arizona at 0.507 so a 10 point differential minus 120 on colorado so we will be taking it as a as an official play the revenge play will happen so as far as rpi goes we did pick up one there. We are waiting on two lines to come out of. So the one we did pick up is Pittsburgh and the Angels. Pittsburgh at .481. Angels at .493. So just over that 10-point parameter. Minus 148 on the Angels. Now, I know both these teams have not played very well here lately. So I honestly can't. I felt like that line would be a little bit lower than it is. But everything lined up. The parameters met. So therefore, we're going to go with it. We are waiting on two lines to come out, one in the Tampa Bay and Seattle, San Diego game. Tampa Bay is at .518, while the Padres at .494. And then, so we're obviously waiting on the Tampa line to post. And then we're waiting on Texas and Toronto. Texas at .501, Toronto at .473. We're waiting on the Rangers line to post there. We did have one unofficial, and it is in Houston and the White Sox. Uh, the Astros are in the top three at .544. The White Sox are at .476. So obviously we're waiting on Houston line. And when it posted, it was minus 300. And therefore is an unofficial play. Way too expensive for us. Two games did not make it due to RPI. The first one missed since uh, Cincinnati and Washington. One point differential difference. And then Boston and Cleveland, a nine point differential. So almost made it, but didn't get there. And therefore, unofficial, or you know, didn't make anything. But like I said, two official plays today for sure. Waiting on two others to be potential plays. I do feel like we will pick up at least one of those. But uh, if not, we still got the two that's going for sure. Colorado on the revenge play and RPI play with the Angels. So that's everything I've got. Appreciate you taking your time to watch this. Have a great Monday, and I will see you later. Thanks. In a good way. Yeah. Brian, I'm going to be honest with you, that smells like pure gasoline. 60% of the time, it works every time.